right, Britain's Prince Harry is helping celebrate his grandmother's Diamond Jubilee. He's visiting several nations as a tribute to the Queen and her 60 year reign. It's his first solo tour overseas. First stop, Belize in Central America. CNN's Max Foster is there. So, uh, Max, has the Prince yet arrived? No, he's due to arrive in the coming hours. And as you say, it's a big deal for him, really, a coming of age, really, in his public role, because he's never represented the Queen uh, abroad before. And so there'll be lots of formalities in terms of that. He'll be speaking on behalf of the Queen. And she's entrusted him uh, with this role, really. So it's going to be a big test to see how he does on it. Uh, he's known as a fun-loving guy. He likes to throw himself into everything. So he's also going to use it as a, uh, as a way of showing his own type of royalty, I think. He's going to be climbing a an ancient Mayan pyramid tomorrow and today we can show you some preparations from the capital where they've closed off a street and there's going to be a street party he's going to turn up uh, to and there's lots of music playing, he's going to try the local cocktails, the local rum, we're told he's going to dance. So whilst there's a serious side to this, he really wants to show the world, uh, perhaps coming out of William's shadow, that he's his own man and he's a fun loving guy but he's got a serious side too. So there's going to be some great images coming out of this but a really sort of significant point in his royal life. Yeah, it looks like he's going to have a lot of fun. So other places uh, where the, the Queen is head of state that Harry uh, may also be attending, where? Yeah, so after this he heads to the Bahamas, uh, and then after that he'll be going to Jamaica, and Jamaica's going to be really interesting next week, and we'll be on the show talking about that, because since the trip was announced, the Prime Minister declared that she wanted to end this relationship with the monarchy, and it's uh, becoming more and more Republican Jamaica, and there is this trend towards getting rid of the monarchy. Interesting that Prince Harry's going to go there, very popular guy wherever he goes, to, to see if he can turn things around. And we're going to be there when he meets the Prime Minister, see if there's any awkwardness, uh, but also lots of other sort of of adventure moments there as well. He's going to be abseiling, he's going to be shooting with the sort of special forces in Jamaica and going out on a speedboat in uh, the Bahamas as well. So lots of good pictures to come. Yeah, he looks like he's always at home no matter where he goes and having a good time. All right, thanks so much. Max Foster there in the jungles of Belize. <laughs>